नमस्ते सीकर्स वेलकम टू पनीस एस्ट्रोलॉजी यो वन स्टॉप एस्ट्रो चैनल भरणी इज अ नक्षत्र विच इज ऑलरेडी एक्सपीरियंसिंग द एनर्जी ऑफ राहु इट्स अ नक्षत्र वेयर वन थिंग एंड्स एंड अ न्यू थिंग बिगिन्स इट्स अ बिगिनिंग ऑफ अ लाइफ साइकिल एंड दैट इज वाई दिस इज रूल्ड बाय यमराज दिस नक्षत्र ऑल्सो डिफाइन्स मदरहुड दिस इज अ नक्षत्र विच ऑन द पॉजिटिव साइड डिफाइन्स लव केयर नर्चरिंग but it has a different side too it is highly occult nakshatra it is the nakshatra of fertilization it is a nakshatra where the tantra is extremely strong and it is highly uh, you can say associated with kundalini shakti because if mars gets corrupted by the maya of rahu then this energy can be explosive you can lose the track and you can fall into the hands of sin you will commit some some negative karma and then you will have to suffer the consequence of that mars in bharani can easily get distracted by the maya and maya is getting stronger and stronger mars in bharani can also make you follow a path that you should not have followed mars in bharani can also make you believe in things that are illusion mars in bharani can also create desires that can overwhelm you that desire overpowers you it sits on your head and it commands you so never let any desire command your head the good thing is that ketu is in libra zodiac sign libra is the manifestation of of desire it is a balance where you you just strike the right balance but the problem is that in order to strike the right balance you will need to do sacrifice sacrifice of what well this means sacrifice of pashvik pravritti animalistic instinct more and more in tune with the nature more and more holistic more and more inclusive more and more you will have to be a uh, uh, close to your relatives family working as a unit this is all about mental war this is how you get influenced mentally so you must first understand who is influencing you mentally and what is influencing you mentally is that influence bringing out the positive from the mind or bringing out the negative from the mind and this influence can come from anybody it can come from your family it can come from your friends it can come from the boss it can come from circumstance it can come from uh, any anything that your sensory sense five senses absorbs so when this nakshatra play happens a thought will develop in your mind which either will drive you to the path of success or will create or awaken your inner demon do not take it lightly this will increase the lust inside your body this will increase the fear inside you this can make you feel more threatened this can increase the chance of accident especially for those who have mars in bharani in 6th 8th or 12th house very specific so if you are if you have mars in bharani in 6th 8th or 12th you need to be careful try to understand mars in bharani is a fertile fertile energy what are you going to do with this fertile land what crop are you going to grow on this fertile land will define how good you, you are in life and what produce you will get so what will happen in the future when a when a when a when a farmer put seed in the land and it plows the land it does not expect the crop to grow overnight what seed will be planted today will give the result in due time mars and rahu is a power packed energy and that energy can be put to great use and you can do that 